This chorus is magical. Magical. Hello, my wonderful royals, and welcome to my YouTube channel, Brick Cape Hot Reacts. And today we are doing the wonderful, wonderful XG once again on the channel. Lots of people have been asking me in the comments and things on my recent videos, are you going to be doing XG? Of course I'm going to be doing XG, guys. Of course. Don't you worry about that. Yes, I'm a few days late on this thing, but that's because I work all week. And at the moment, I haven't really got time to uh, record during the week because by the time I get back, it's getting dark and stuff. So I don't really record during the week. So I, I can only really record the weekend, which is what this is right now for me, it's Saturday. So this is the time at the moment where I sit down and I catch up on all the stuff that's come out in the last week. And XG is of course one of those things, kind of for me, the major thing that's come out this week, because this is a group that I'm hugely, hugely excited for, really excited for. Um, I read to them for the first time a few months ago, a few months back when Mascara came out. Was it, I can't remember now off the top of my head, if it was when Mascara came out, if it was, like a few weeks or whatever after mascara and i just i found them randomly i can't remember now <laughs> the top of my head i can't remember um let me know if you've watched that reaction recently uh remind me of the situation but um i did discover xg uh checked out mascara checked out tippy toes um checked out a few like live react uh live performances and stuff on um, so a couple of those reactions i did two reactions i think on them um and i was immediately hooked immediately hooked tippy toes is still one of my favourites of the year last year it is in my list of favourites of the year that I put out at the end of 2022, like a top 100 list it is in there because I, I, I just adore that song. Mascara, not as much as Tippy Toes, but I still loved it. Like this group have something. <laughs> they really, really do have something. Um, I've been meaning for ages, to be honest, to get back on them and check out all their pre-release stuff. And that, that that was my intention was to go and react to all the pre-release stuff. I never got around to it in the end. So maybe this will kind of kickstart that because I really do want to go back and check out all the content and stuff and properly get to know this group, which I feel like I've not done yet. Like I know this group and I know the members to a degree and the names and stuff like that, but I, I'm not a hundred percent confident, you know, and I've not checked out a lot of the content. So I do want to, kickstart that and hopefully this will be that because they have released another single album uh called shooting star so the the main the title track on it is called shooting star which is the mv we're going to be checking out today um i am also going to be checking out the b-side left and right not not left hand. it's left just just left right isn't it it's not left and right it's left right um which feels weird to say <laughs> like i want to say left and right but it's left right um but yeah we'll be checking that out as well there is a live performance of both of these so I'm, I'm thinking i might check out shooting star if i really love the mv and the song i might just check out the live performance of that as well so we'll see how it goes <laughs> but that is the plan uh today if you're new here hello if you're an xg fan if you are an alpha please do check out my previous reactions to them like i say there are only two on the channel i read to the uh, two tippy toes, two mascara, uh, and a couple of live performances. So please do go back and check all that out and catch up on my XG journey thus far. That would be incredible. And of course, guys, if you enjoyed this reaction, please drop us a like, drop us a comment, and of course, subscribe to my lovely self. Join the royal family, become a royal yourself. That would be fantastic. Join my Discord, guys. Uh, the link is always in the description below. I do have a donation page now that you can get involved in if you want to support me anymore on my dream of making this a kind of full-time job. Um, getting involved on that would be fantastic and would mean a lot to me personally. Um, if you fancy it, there is a link in the description below to that as well. Um, but with all that being said, we're just going to get straight into this thing because I'm ready. <laughs> I'm ready to finally, I've been itching a week to get hold of this thing. It is XG time! Let's do this! So this is the wonderful XG, uh, the global girl group, um, which, you know, or already for me sets them apart. Like, I love what they're doing with this whole thing. You know, the fact they're a Japanese group um in the korean market but also kind of um promoting globally as a global girl group singing in english like it's such an interesting idea and i'm, I'm just so on board with it um this is shooting star let's do it man. <laughs> let's do it oh my god i've been desperate to check this thing out so look at harvey Oh god. God. Coconut, coconut. Oh my god. She's a badass. 
Harvey's my girl, she's my bias for anyone that doesn't know. Oh, of course. Is that, is that uh, Julia? Look at the out the outfits and everything. Oh Oh Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, oh, oh. yes, oh, I, I love this direction, I love this direction, absolute yes, I think, thinking of the way the XG came out of the blocks with tippy toes and with um, mascara, they very much had that like, you know, cool girl in your face, hitting hard kind of image even though tippy toes was very different in terms of the style of song and stuff and it did have parts especially that vocal part with like Julia and stuff where it, am i getting the name yeah Julia is the main vocalist right this is what i'm saying i need to learn the members a bit better <laughs> i'm pretty sure i'm right on in thinking that because there's Ju there's Julia and then there's um Julian, right and I'm, i think Julia is the main vocalist um yeah, there was like a bit with her and stuff. So you could tell they had that uh, smoothness about them. They had that, um, that uh, kind of R&B-esque uh, quali vocal quality about them as well. Um, but they gave us that kind of image of those two songs. And I kind of thought that's where we were going after the start of this one. Like when it comes in initially with that verse and stuff of the rap and thing. I was thinking, yeah, that's where we're going here. But that chorus, man, that that chorus, yes, I was not expecting that. It goes in a completely different direction. And I like it, I like it, I like that we're seeing this side of them. That was a really nice chorus. I love the visuals on the MV as well, just the way the girls look in this is incredible. When the teaser images dropped and they had that like blue hair and everything, the blue hair look that they've got going on in the MV, I absolutely adore that. They all had the blue hair, I was like, yes, this is perfect, absolutely perfect. This group has so much like charisma that they're one of, for me, they're one of the most charismatic groups, like, in the whole industry at the moment. Um, I don't want to call them K-pop group, because <laughs> they're not technically other than I guess, the, would you call them, you wouldn't even call them J-pop, I suppose they're a global girl group, that's the point, isn't it? But I don't really know how to classify them, because they're promoted in Korea, but they are the, the J-pop, if anything. <laughs> but I don't know where they classify, really, but, I, I, yeah. Regardless of what you'd call them, um, within let's say the K-pop industry, um, for me they're one of the most charismatic. Like they just they just leap out of the screen at you, and I say that about a lot of groups, but XG are one of the absolute top top groups for it at the moment for me. Um, I absolutely love them. <laughs> I absolutely love the whole, but just the presence. The presence is so powerful, and even with this, which is a bit softer and stuff in the chorus, they still have that presence about them. They still have that cool factor about them, which is so prominent with this group like it's, it's something i said about um i think on my 2022 songs of the year list when i had tippy toes i had little captions and stuff a little comment about the song on every one and i think the one for tippy toes was the coolest song of 2022 and i stand by that um i think i said tick tick boom by classy was as well like it's debatable i, I love both of those. but they just have that cool factor about them um, and this this displays that even though it's softer and it's got all these like bright cute you know uh aesthetics with like the rainbows going off and all these the flowers and stuff despite that they still look cool and i like them um just gorgeous man just gorgeous the outfits and everything oh they, this group just like put, they can pull off anything and i love that right continue <laughs> continue <laughs> Oh, I was not ready for this chorus.
Harvey is a goddess, man. He's a goddess. What a boss. I love Jodie's voice. I love her voice. Like, like I love it. I adore it. and everything, the looks, they're going all out for this. <laughs> oh my god, this MV is gorgeous. The blue hair, the blue hair. This chorus is magical, magical. <laughs> Army breaks. Oh my god, that was good. Wow. They, they of course, are watching this flipping <laughs> live stage, mate. It came up afterwards, and yes, we are. But no, I, I don't want this though. I just love it. I don't agree to Hello Fresh. Round of that. We're going to watch the live stage in a minute. <laughs> in a minute, once I've gathered my thoughts. Just wow. Just wow, man. They, they, they slay everything they do. There's a. There's a. An unerring confidence about this group that what it does is that it it convinces you that everything they do will be perfect <laughs> like i can't describe it better than that there's just something about there's a, le a level of confidence you can have as an artist and it normally comes into play a number of years in it normally could like it normally takes a number of years for an artist to gain the confidence and that aura about them to where they can release anything and sell it purely based on that confidence alone you know someone like a Beyonce someone like a a Taylor Swift someone like th th those top top artists that have been around for years that have been in the game for years they can release anything and sell it because they just have that confidence about them to where you just can't deny that we, regardless of whether you like something or not really <laughs> it's just like they have such confidence that they, they they sell it regardless. They just sell it to you. They just and within the realms of K-pop, we have groups like that and stuff, obviously. But this group have it already. <laughs> this group kind of have it already. Like I watch what they do, and they just sell it to me. And granted, this song was fantastic, regardless. Like Shooting Star is a fantastic song, regardless of of what they're doing. But there's just something about the aura and the confidence and the presence of this group that just sells it to me. I feel like they could do whatever they wanted on that stage and it would, I would buy into it because of, just because of the way that they're selling it. Um, there's just something about the confidence of this group that is kind of unlike anything else that I'm seeing right now. And, and that, and that's pretty incredible. <laughs> that's pretty incredible for a group that had been around for, like two minutes really let's be honest not long at all um just wow that whole mv was fantastic i love the the visuals of it that we got they really went all out in terms of like budget and stuff in terms of making it look good which i really appreciate the girls looked absolutely phenomenal um all the outfits and stuff the different the hair and the, all the blue hair look was insane um again like i say they had even when they had like the cute visuals with like the rainbows and stuff and the unicorn type aesthetic and that kind of thing, they still looked just so cool. <laughs> they just have that cool factor, like I say. Harvey, man. Harvey is... <sighs> They're all superstars, right? But Harvey for me, and obviously Harvey's my bias, so I am biased when I say this, but Harvey for me just has... Her presence is, is off the charts, off the charts. And I say that for a 
granted I say that a lot for, for a lot of different idols, but seriously, I cannot stress enough. Harvey has such a presence about her, it's insane. When, when she's on the screen, she just emanates that just coolness. I, just, I can't, you can't keep your eyes off her. Like she's so, she just draws you in. She absolutely draws you in. I, <laughs> this group is so good, man. This group are incredible. Right, I'm going to watch this live stage for Shooting Star before we go on to the B-side because I want to appreciate it even more. And quite frankly, I want to listen to it again. So that's what we're doing. Shooting Star live stage. This is on their channel, so I shouldn't get blocks for it in theory. Look at it, that's it. Look at it, that's it. That blonde hair, man. I... Shooting, shooting. I like the short hair, that works. Even these verses work so well. She breaks me whenever she's on the screen, I'm sorry, I can't. In voice does it for me, man. I just love it. I adore it. This chorus, this chorus. Oh, this needs to get attention. All the attention. Outfits and so like spacey, like cyber. I don't want to say cyberpunk, but like it's spacey. Space aesthetic, sci fi. Kokona is like a rapper. She's got presents. Look at her. <laughs> Oh! To be fair, I mean, they've got a whole, like, UFO situation going on on the top, so it is very much a space aesthetic, alien-type vibe. Um, it's working, I'll tell you that. Was that in the MV as well? If I just, I, I need to re-watch that MV, man. <laughs> All the different looks that were going off, and... Um, I don't know if this, the, this... I'm assuming it probably was. Um in the MV as well. They look, they look incredible. They, uh, <laughs> oh, the presence, the presence is so exciting. This group are exciting. They really are. I can't deal with it. I say it at the start, Inata, yeah. Um, the blonde hair. I can't, I, have we seen her with dark hair yet? I feel like she had blonde during mascara, right? I'm sure I'm right in thinking that. I can't remember if she didn't tippy toes. Um, I can't remember. If, I can't remember off the top of my head. Like she, so, she suits that blonde hair so so much. Man. <laughs> I'm not surprised they haven't changed it because she just it just works. God damn right. <laughs> Continue with your shiny pants. I love that hair. And then what's the, what's that style called? This chorus, mate. It's so good. This bit's so nice as well. Nat has got a really nice voice. Oh my god, Jordan. I like the choreo as well. Everything about this is so good! Starring on his top. 
No, no. <laughs> Stop murdering me. Stop it. Stop it. I need to survive so I can check out the B-side. You sent Colonel. They're phenomenal. They're absolutely phenomenal. They're absolutely phenomenal. I, I... They're screwed, man. They have, they have something. They have something. I want to get the album, man. What? Is the album still available? I know they only released like limited. I got that one uh, quite soon after checking out mascara and stuff. But I know they only release like limited numbers because I've noticed that is that album is going for a lot <laughs> on like eBay and stuff right now. Like it's going for a lot of money. Um, I assume the same can the same is probably this, it's the same for like tippy toes and stuff because I wanted to get that album really bad, but I couldn't find anywhere. And if you do find it, it's ridiculous prices. And yeah, I think it's because they only release limited numbers. So I don't know if this album is even still available. I kind of hope it is because I want it, <laughs> to be honest. Ah, uh, oh, Jesus Christ. I... Wow. Well. <laughs> Just wow, this group. I can't deal. I like the fact that we're, see we're getting to experience their vocals in this song a lot more. Like it's re it's very vocal focused and I like that um, because there are some really nice vocals in this group. Is Maya a vocalist? Is she a vocalist? I don't know enough to know, but let me know. <laughs> let me know in the comments details like that. Um, but yeah, we, I'm going to move on to the B-side now because I really want to check this out as well. I've heard good things about this B-side. Uh, left, right. Not left and right. Left, right. Just left, right. Just left, right. I need to remember that. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna watch the live stage of that. I uh, wish they have released. I don't. Um, they didn't. They didn't. Do they do like uh, MVs for B sides? Do you reckon? Do you reckon? Are we likely to get that? I don't know. Uh, left, right. Let's do it. Wait, are there subs? Because if there are subs, I want to know lyrics. No. Okay. Fine. Continue. Look at her presences. I cannot take my eyes off that woman when she's on screen. Like she, just, her eyes and everything, she just pulls you in. Join in. Join is such a badass. Oh, oh. oh I like Jordan's voice as well. Now I'm obsessed. That I'm obsessed. All over again. All over again. The choreo, the jacket thing. The jacket thing. Putting the jacket on. Oh my god. Yes. <laughs> yes. How can something so simple make me so like giddy inside? How does that work? I don't know. Well, they make it work. Um Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. This group deserve, just based on this alone, they deserve like new genes type attention. Like if we're talking about groups that are coming out with stuff that is kind of different and, and a bit left field, but still so utterly gorgeous, that's the kind of attention that new genes are getting. XG deserve that. They deserve that right now because they're doing stuff that I'm not hearing in K-pop. Um, obviously, they're a global girl group and all that, but <laughs> regardless, like they're in the K-pop industry. And I'm not hearing stuff like this. And this needs attention. This needs attention. Like, come on. Give them the new jeans hype, people. They deserve it. My God. This is so good. I want to watch that jacket bit again. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> Me 
they're just selling. They're selling the outfits. They're selling the the choreo. They're selling the visuals. They're selling the jacket. They're selling everything. Inata, Inata. She might be my record, man. She might be my record. She kills me. Oh, that hola, hola. Yes. Yes. Oh, why is this so good? This song, this song, though. Is this better than the title track? I honestly don't know. Oh, cool. That the elbow. <laughs> the elbow. Oh my god. The voice. It hurts me. Their vocals sound so good. <laughs> the vocals sound so good. Help me. Oh my god. I love that. That. Oh, it's so perfect. They're so cool. Everything they do. The fact that they can just do that and make it look really cool. I can't make that look cool. Look a twat. But <laughs> they do it and it looks incredible. How how does that work? <laughs> What's your secret, XG? What is your secret? That was incredible, mate. That was incredible. I might prefer that song to the title track, honestly, don't know. <laughs> I can't deal with it. Canny deal. It's ridiculous. I. Uh, I think they blow my mind all over again. But honestly, I'll absolutely admit to the fact that, um, you know, they they initially blew my mind. But then, you know, I didn't obviously follow it up and do reactions to them again and stuff and do all the pre release stuff, which I was intending to do, but for some reason I just didn't. Um, uh, and then, uh, you know, but now I feel like checking this, it's like they've just blown my mind all over again. I've become obsessed all over again. Um, and now I flip in will go back and do all the pre-release stuff and all that jazz and whatever you guys want me to do. If there's stuff that I can do, flip it out, let me know. This group are insane. This group are insane. I cannot say much more than that really they, they they are utterly incredible um uh, i think uh you know like vocalists and stuff i was thinking this earlier <laughs> no i think i just had it confirmed to me because i was looking at the names on the billboard and stuff to kind of familiarize myself with the names a bit more and I forgot to mention, um, I've not mentioned uh, Chisa, 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 is that how you pronounce it, Chisa, throughout the reaction. I think she had, a lot of the time, sometimes when I mentioned Julia in the last one, I think I was talking about Chisa, to be honest, in terms of like the vocals and stuff. Um, I think I got mixed up between the two. Uh, Chisa, she has an amazing voice as well. I really like her voice. Um, I think, is she a main vocalist as well in this group? I'm not 100%. If she's not, she should be, because she's got an incredible voice. Um, and obviously, Julia also does. Um, that song, again, it showed off the vocals so nicely. I love the smoothness of it. Again, it had that R&B quality. Um, I just really like what they're doing. I just really, really like what they're doing. <laughs> like, I can't say much more than that, really. Um, and that, this is such a contrast, I feel like, to the previous stuff, like Tippy Toes and... Um, 
mascara. They have a kind of style about a certain sound to them, I feel like, that is represented in all of those songs. But they, these two go in a different direction, and I really like the direction they go in. Um, it really, really works. The, this this group are superstars, like legit superstars. I just, re I really hope they explode. Honestly, I really hope they explode. I really hope they explode globally. Like, I, just, I feel like they deserve the attention. Like I say, for me, they deserve that new jeans hype. They deserve that kind of attention because they are doing something different. They are doing something exciting. They are doing something fresh, and they are delivering it with a presence that. No group that has only been around for as long as they have have the right to have. They, like, do you know what I mean? Like that confidence, that presence, and stuff. They should not have that at this point. It's dead. Given how long they've been going, they should not have that, and yet they do. And yet they do, man. It's and it is legit. It's not even like fake or whatever. It's it's legit. It's legit confidence. It's legit presence. And it's insane that they've got it at this point, and it helps them just deliver everything that they do. I'm stunned. I'm absolutely stunned. And with that being said, guys, we'll leave it there. Thank you so much for watching. Please, if you enjoyed this reaction, drop us a like, drop us a comment, and of course, subscribe to my lovely self. Join the Royal Family, become a Royal yourself. Get those comments, guys. Um, I know you XG fans are very vocal, and I want to hear that in the comments. I want you guys to tell me what I should check out, because I want to check out all their stuff. I should have done it last time, and I didn't, and I need to get on the... Because I know there's pre-release stuff and stuff like that. If there's anything you guys want me to check out, by all means, tell me. I know there was an X Gals. What? What the flipping out was it called? X Gals Two or something released. I never checked that out because I was always going to react to it and I never did. What was that called? <laughs> okay, like X Gals. Gals Gals Zypher. Zypher is that how you say? I didn't. I never checked that out. So maybe I'll do that. Um, pretty soon. Let me know. All that stuff in the comments. And I'll see you next time, guys, for the next one. Sanenge, I love you all. Goodbye.